It's about people, it's about children, it's about a charity's fundamental belief that children with the toughest start in life can change, can be given a chance. I told my foster parents where to go, just like the last ones. Don't trust no one, I ain't changing, ever. It's really about trying to put forward a philosophy, a very positive philosophy that children deserve to be believed in. It's a charity that people respect incredibly and, and you know, it has a very fond place in people's hearts, I think. What the film shows is the extraordinary journey a person can go on in the first 30 years of their life. How you can start in all kinds of troubled circumstances and they can have a real bearing on how you turn out. But equally, it shows that if somebody does step in and help and believe how a life can be put back on the rails and can end up with a very, very meaningful future. The film starts with Michael as a 30-year-old adult, a rounded human being with a full life, a child on the way, everything to live for, a future ahead of him, and he talks about his life. Yeah, yeah, no, things are good. Got a job, got a girlfriend, got a little boy. He never goes through the things that I did. But as he talks about his life, he gets younger. He was a very, very angry, troubled teenager, a very, very antisocial person. But as you watch the film develop, and he gets younger and younger, you see where he's come from. Mommy's boyfriend hits me. I try to hide, but always finds me. There are lots of different issues at different times of life, and Bernardo's helps pretty much all of those stages. We really want people to realise that, you know, a kid who has had all these problems in the past can really change. I think the script really does um, represent the life story of so many vulnerable children out there in the UK. They just never give up on them. When you read the case studies of these kids, um, you really, I mean, it really does ignite your passion. It tells a really emotional story and it makes you think behind the story that you're seeing. Any individual they deal with, they always look at what is in this person's past, try and understand how this individual became, and that's what this film's about. You could have done it through CGI, you know, through computer graphics. You could have seen him more from a 30-year-old into a five-year-old. But my feeling was that the viewer would probably be more caught up by the actual technique. The, the sort of power of the message would actually be lost. My idea was basically to make it feel like one shot but use actually very old-fashioned editing techniques to kind of get from, from one character to another. This film wasn't just a technical challenge, it was also a dramatic challenge, and the dramatic challenge, if anything, is the more important one. And you had to coax some very real and very moving performances out of these children. I'm scared. When we found out that Jason, who plays Michael, aged 30, had been through care as a young lad. Uh, we couldn't believe it. That's the story. That's what this is all about. When I got the script and I see from uh, the five-year-old up to the 30-year-old, I was like, this isn't a script, this is my life story here. Yeah. I know about the anger and the roles of, of the 24-year-old. You see him, like, he's calmed down a bit, but the 18-year-old, he's, you know, you can see he's quite a cannon. I was insecure, you know, avoiding attachment to everything and everyone. Now I'm, I'm, I'm a CEO of my own company, it's up and coming. You know, so things for me are good, you know, they are generally really good. So playing the part as Michael is just like, yeah, things are good. No, that's, that's the truth, you know, got a girlfriend, that's the truth. Kid, not yet, but we'll see. I'm getting a bit better now. It's like I can see a way out. That woman from Bernardo's, she's all right. We talk a lot, and I trust her. It kind of really gets across the amount of work Bernardo's do in order to take a quite broken spirit and build him up and push him out into the world at the other end as, as someone that can just deal with stuff and be confident in themselves. If anything that I could do to help Bernardo's or show support, I let people out there know that if there's a charity you need to help, this is the charity that makes a difference to younger people. Mm -hmm.